Hi everyone, this is Kim and I am here with another project for Handicraft Suppliers Design Team. Um, I have to say I have enjoyed being on this design team so much and I absolutely love the flowers um, that we were given in our, our design team packages. Um, I absolutely, absolutely, sorry, a little tongue twisting there, um, absolutely love, love, love their flowers. Um, I am going to leave the links for the YouTube, the Facebook, and their store in the description box below. And you need to check them out because they've gotten some new flowers in that are um, printed flowers. So they have some printing on them. Some of them, I believe, have music notes. Some have uh, lettering, um, some script. And um, they have some other ones that you, you really just need to check them out. And their prices are amazing. And you get a lot of flowers for your book, I'm, I'm telling you. So you need to go and, and check them out. So first let me start by showing you the products that I used for this uh, project that I did this time. This is um, just a small project that I did this time because my next project is going to be much bigger so I wanted to do something smaller this time but the flowers just absolutely make this, this project just pop for me. So let me start out with showing you I used some of these um, mini rose buds in a cream color and the item is 353C25 and I believe these are the 7 millimeter. Very pretty. And then I also which are used which are my favorite are the gardenias. I just and you get a ton of gardenias for a very small price. And I use these beautiful pink ones. And the item is 21530-02, and you get 25 to a pack. And these are the, I believe, um, 50 millimeter. This is 5 centimeter. I think that comes out to be 50 millimeter. Um, I'm pretty sure. And you, these are the pink ones. Absolutely beautiful. And then I also use these 35 millimeter open roses in uh, pink and the number is 3550-10 you get 10 in a pack and the color is 253 and these are absolutely a beautiful pink and I just have to say I hate pink but these are gorgeous these are beautiful pink flowers and they're, the color that they have on these are absolutely beautiful and I am not a pink person. I'm more this color back here. I love these colors but I, every project I have done for them I have used some sort of uh, pastel pink color. Absolutely beautiful. Um, so let me show you what I have done. Let me move my sign out of the way. This is a little altered jelly jar. Isn't it stinking cute? I absolutely love this. And what I have done is I gessoed the jar, but you can still see some of the jar underneath. I didn't want to completely cover up the, the jar. I've added some beautiful laces. I layered through here. And then I have this beautiful trim with some pearls. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. Absolutely gorgeous. And then for the top, I just sewed the, the top of the jar as well and then I have a doily which is kind of hard to see up underneath but it's a beautiful doily and then these beautiful flowers and there's that pink 35 millimeter open rose and then I used two of the large gardenias absolutely beautiful and then four of the seven millimeter open rose or rosebuds, not open roses, rosebuds. And then I've tucked in some flat back pearls around. And then I have this beautiful pink pearl trim that I had in my stash. And I added that. And then I gessoed everything. Or no, I didn't. I'm sorry. I was thinking I did, but I didn't. That was a my bad. Sorry about that. But I don't think they it really needed it to, to be gessoed anyways because these are just so such soft colors that they just they 
are amazing just by themselves. And this is filled with goodies for a special somebody. And I hope she uh, likes what I have done for her. And I absolutely loved doing this little jar. And uh, you really need to check out the other designers uh, for handicraft suppliers. They have some amazing projects. And uh, like I said, I have enjoyed being on this team immensely. And um, I hope when the next go around comes for design team members that um, I will apply again. And I hope I'm, I can remain. So thanks for stopping by. And uh, like I said, please check out the other designers. Um, I will leave the links to their YouTube channels down below just so you can uh, check them out. All right. Thanks. Bye.